Hi, I'm Jale. Welcome to my channel. This is going to be a reading for Capricorn or placements and or the cross watcher from basically when you see this to the next set of Capricorn readings. Uh, remember, this is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave the rest. If you feel like this is not your message, that's fine. Uh, just check other placements. Maybe I'll pick up on you from somewhere else. And or if you want a personalised reading, information is in the description box below. Um, let me know if you prefer this non-timing thing. Uh, I feel like it's better, but again, it's your choice. Let's see for the Capricorns here what is going on, what is happening for Capricorns. Okay, so we've got some kind of... Oh, no, no, don't want to burn that card. Nearly went in the candle. There's some kind of possible karmic contract and or marriage contract or some kind of spiritual contract here that involves a connection where there could be a possible pregnancy that is being announced um now weirdly i feel like whatever this surrounding this may not come out um immediately is how i want to say it but let's have a look what is this what is going on for the capricorn spirit what is going on for the capricorns what is happening here wow okay so someone yeah there's unfinished business here someone does not want to let go of a, a connection and somebody also doesn't want to be alone it's like again embracing family hmm. so maybe they've already got children with this person here but it's like maybe they've just found out that someone's expecting and someone's disconnected it and had an argument but they haven't quite resolved the situation but there's some kind of confusion around this that is not being looked at right capricorn what else so we've got someone's belief system where they're very rigid and stubborn so again assistance without interference so it could be that someone's not telling anyone about this because they don't want anyone else to get involved um but again some something doesn't quite add up about all this though because again we've got the riddle here again we've got paradox and self-sacrificing so someone could have got involved in a situation that isn't even theirs to get involved with in terms of a pregnancy or some kind of con you know karma and i think it's because they feel sorry for this person i think they feel bad for this person and they're doing it because they think that that's going to help this other person. Right, Capricorn. Yeah. This is a karmic contract. This is... A, someone is in a karmic contract either because they're involved in a relationship when someone's got pregnant and now they're taking that on board or they've got the person pregnant but either way somebody in the situation there is something that is not quite adding up about this and it's not quite adding into the you know one plus one is not equaling equaling two in this situation but because of that because of the fact that there's unfinished business this person feels that they're responsible for that spirit what is going on with the capricorns we've got wounded energy and rather than facing it someone's in a lot of pain and regret and again it's because of this child someone is not accepting <laughs> someone's not accepting no for an answer here so maybe this person isn't even the father and this person wants this other person to take responsibility for it but they're not the father and so they're not taking responsibility for it and now this other person's not happy there's a new cycle here and again this could even be the birth of a child on its way and again maybe someone's having to offer a commitment or needs to offer a commitment maybe that's what is expected but they don't want to and maybe that's let's see maybe something's being hidden behind the scenes here about all this right what is going on for the capricorns oh we've got cards yeah we've got a family setting here someone's trying to defend against getting into a family setting it could even be it could even be that 
this person's already said they don't want kids or something and now let's see let's see what's going on for capricorns yeah this person's not having any of it so they could have already walked away from the situation because they know something's not adding up and they they are wanting to do their own thing they don't want anything to do with this now because they're scared because they don't know what to do because things are hidden right now let's see show me more and again because maybe they don't want to have that commitment they don't want to be involved in this they don't want to be building something with somebody that they don't want to be with so this person could have actually got somebody pregnant doesn't want didn't want to and now this person's like you're going to deal with this and now this other person's running away this person is running from commitment and responsibility they don't want to they don't want any involvement they're running this person is like running away from the responsibility of this child right i'm not sure what the what is the riddle what is this why are they confused what is this riddle about why are they so confused What is the Wheel of Fortune? They may already be in another relationship. They may already be in another relationship. And they don't want this to come out and it's going to, which means that, yeah, which means this is all gonna, yeah, which is why the storm is here. So someone's got somebody else pregnant, but they're already in another relationship. And this person's needing them to step up, but they're not and yeah time is running out and this is a part of a karmic contract we've got justice in the wheel of fortune here so someone is yeah this is about to get re revealed as well if you don't already know about this this is about to get revealed yep and it's about money it's going to the arguments is going to be about money the main reason this is brought up is going to be about money i don't think this person has money to give and that's why this person's terrified and i think this person is slaving away right now ready to go to war with this other person because they they don't they don't want they don't see any future here they're they don't want anything to do with this um they are still not even sure if they're going to have anything to do with the child and this they don't trust the, the the mother of the child either they do not trust the mother of the child there is no emotions with the mother of the child and there are too many people involved in this situation so I don't know if this you're the mother. I don't know if you're the person that's involved with the guy. I don't know if you're someone else external to the situation. But this is what's going on. And let me see if I can get you some more information. What else? The Capricorn spirit. Okay, this is not about to close out anytime soon. There's going to be... I think someone else could even be the father because there's going to be news coming out this is not going to get close soon because there's going to be more information coming out and why do I feel like it's done deliberately to get the the person who's running to go back towards this this expectant mother to try and arrange something but all it's going to do is backfire because this person's going to be like okay great they can look after the child bye i'm out but there is way too many people in this situation right here right what else for capricorn yep someone is <clears throat> actually around this other person who is willing to take responsibility for this child as well there is somebody that is actually willing to be responsible for this child 
but do you know what is really interesting i don't think this person wants them i think this person wants the the the, the actual father i don't i think this person possibly try to do this deliberately to get them to acknowledge them but because this person's already in a relationship that was never going to happen and this is like there's just a lot of arguing there's a lot of arguing here and there's going to be a lot of arguing uh, until this is resolved and i don't know if this is going to get resolved in any time soon especially yeah look this is this is not going to get resolved any any time soon from where i'm seeing it right yep and i'm going to be honest with you the guy who's actually going towards this female is probably also going to get rejected because she wants this other there's something as well about this pride thing about getting this person pregnant like it's about getting this person to acknowledge what they've done and that's more what this other the pregnant woman wants and i don't think that's going to happen i think this this person's going to avoid that yeah there's more stuff hidden what is hidden what is the hidden what is hidden what is the high priestess show me oh lord this other pa okay either the person who's avoiding the pregnancy is involved in somebody who is already going towards somebody else or the pregnant woman is already involved with somebody else married and or this person's about to divorce them and it's not even their child and they're about to find out but there's way too many people in the situation it's like everyone has a karmic in this situation like there is multiple karmics going on here and one pregnancy and everyone is like covering it up november this is all gonna this is not gonna start getting revealed until at least november and if this is you and you don't are not like directly linked to this i would be standing well out of it because this is like and if this is your person just you know stand totally back because yeah look this person this this has to heal and again this won't be till the end of november where this is going to even start probably being healed yeah there's too much going on there's way too many there is going to be a relationship that ends from it as well because of all this and a choice and decision being made and a reconciliation but you this is not going to be anytime soon so if someone's trying to force this through quickly no that's not going to happen there's too many people involved there's way too many yeah look and there's also a uh, possible multiple car like karmic contracts here but there's a lot of go stuff going on behind the scenes that is not being even that's a whole separate issue as well it's like there's more layers to this um i'm just hearing someone can't admit the truth either someone cannot admit the truth that's going to be really relevant to somebody listening to this as well because someone would have you're going to probably have said that you're, so you're going to know it's you but someone cannot mi admit the truth so if this is your person and they're in the middle of it and they can't admit the truth this is probably your reading um but that's the exact words i'm hearing to for you to know that this is for you um and i just keep hearing don't back down this is somebody's ancestor i'm hearing as well this i'm telling you this all this stuff is going to come out and it's going to be I, don't, I keep seeing 1 to 14 so this could even be in the next two weeks that you're going to start seeing all this what else yeah and this person who is already around someone else and involved with this female possibly even around a, there's three people around this guy and at the moment he's trying to fight off this child this mother of this child right final final message yeah yeah i mean this is a hundred percent a message i'd give you too is keep your composure like whatever you do 
if you are in the middle of this you are going to have to use your willpower and strength to absolutely compose yourself in amongst this situation because this is no joke right here this is a lot and take a break okay if this is very much on your mind take a break with it because this is a lot to have to deal with right here we've got vulnerability and, and freedom so there is a, an option of freeing yourself from this and a positive resolution but it is going to involve a lot of this is a lot of healing and a lot of work and we've got raise your vibration so you know try and stay above it because this is this is no this is no joke like let me get a Ganesha card for advice for you because I feel like someone's going to need that and I don't know why but I feel like I need to cry so I don't know if someone's watching this crying um I'm just hearing it will be okay so and I don't know why but you could even have a child who's told you that as well that's what I need to say to you and I keep hearing reach out as well so I don't know if you've got friends that have been asking how you are and you don't tell them any of this but I will be telling somebody because this feels like a heavy and especially if you're a Capricorn and I know my sister's a Capricorn she doesn't reach out for anything so and I know you know not everybody's like that but just don't keep all this in try and get someone to understand your point of view steadfastness this is about being stubborn and positive outlook so keep focus if this is your person you're gonna have to really take breaks from this because this is a heck of a this is a this is um a test for you uh do, again it's like what do you take from this situation it's like building up a strength from something that is adverse you know such an adversity final message for the well okay not so final message then so we've got balance shamanic journey confusion and homing beacon so if i was you i'd be looking into a shamanic practitioner to try and do some really deep subconscious work because whatever this is this is like part of your healing process too but there's a homing beacon here so this is coming back to the self coming back to alignment but also the right person coming to you as well and if that's your person that to be done in a peaceful manner last message for capricorns without all the cards going everywhere please that's just yeah look spiritual commitment so this is a part of a path here that is trying to teach you um how to have a balanced relationship with the self what you're testing every belief system you've got they're saying go easy on yourself all right so hopefully that helps thank you for your likes your shares and your your all your sort of subscriptions here your um support for the channel it means a lot to me until next time take care